Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be talking about Valorant Patch Notes 9.03. So instead of me just talking about blah, 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 let's just get right into the video. So, hey, folks, I'm Ash. I'm the new community manager on the team. Don't worry, Joel Ellen's still here, and I'll be helping her out in the, with the patch notes from now on. So you'll see me time to time. I'm excited to start sharing the updates with y'all. So let's get right into the patch notes 9.03. We made improvements to ground spreading abilities and added a preview to Sage Berry Orb. So now, anytime the Sage uh, Barrier is now placed on the map, well, sorry, anytime it's placed on the map, it'll sh be shown on the mini map. Next, we have also uh, added Pearl uh, entering unrated and swift play use on console. Huge W. Pearl is easily one of the best maps in the game. So for all platforms, made improvements for overlapping interactable objects work. So you should now perform desired actions more consistently. For example, a dart from Cypher's cam should no longer prevent you from going onto a rope. I think that's a huge W. I definitely, definitely looking forward to the future on that. Agent updates, ground spreading abilities. We're making improvements to abilities that spread along the ground like Primstone's Molly and Viper Snake Bite. Previously, these abilities now were inconsistent, and now they're more kind of uh, more predictable. So, for example, now if I pull up the photo in the previous 9.02 and below, this is what the image appears to be like. You will see the Molly, well, in this case, the Brim Molly, but it will also happen to the Viper Molly, will bleed through the wall. Now, that won't actually happen. So there will be less uh, visual bugs. Uh, map target abilities. You can now ping and see additional icons on the map used for ability targeting. Frames, uh, sky smoke, orbital strike, close ruse, omen from the shadows. All huge W's. Um, now we got more stuff about the sage wall. Performance updates. And this is a huge, this is huge. ISO. Kill contract ability performance improved. This is absolutely amazing. Like, I don't know how many times I've been ISO ulted and my frames just goddamn drop. Bug fixes, fix an issue where opening menus would reset your toggle crouch slash toggle walk state. Now that hasn't happened to me yet, but always gotta fix those bugs. Fix your game, Riot. Fix your game. Uh, next is gameplay systems. I'm not gonna really cover this. It's just basically visual stuff. I, I guess the only big one is fix an issue with auto rescoping for the outlaw marshal and operator staying active while the gun goes to a reload. I guess the only thing that's not a visual um, bug or a game system bug. But that's a huge. I can again fix your game, right? Fix your game. Maps abyss. Fix a spot mid library where throwing abilities can be clipped through the shelves into gameplay space. Cool. Fix a spot where agent uh, utility could be thrown off the map and used as a platform. Okay. I revised the message. And if you don't know what this is, this is basically, this is basically the, kind of the tease for the next agent that's been happening on Abyss. Next, uh, fix a minor visual issue with the railings around defender spawn. Uh, the range, fix a bug where certain words in the range weren't translated correctly into various languages. Big W. PC bug fixes, combat report, bug fix. Blah, blah, blah. I won't cover that. Uh, console map updates. Pearl now enters unrated and swift plays. Now it won't enter ranked, guys. It won't enter ranked until 9.06. And I believe that's going to be sometime in September. Known issues. General. Fix an issue where opening the ability map in the shop slash scoreboard simultaneously could result in a loss of input. Huge W, that's actually happened to me before. Not fun to deal with. Next, fixed an issue with pressing the ability button while defusing the spike would equip a weapon. Next, we have agent bug fixes. Harbor, fix an issue where harbor high tides would end prematurely. So that's it pretty much for all the updates and the patch notes. Now I have other stuff that I've seen in Valorant news. So we have new skin coming to the game, a new Vandal, Spectre, uh, Wonder Hammer, Frenzy, Guardian, the banners. Not my cup of tea, but maybe from other people's cup of teas. Here's the hammer. Kind of looks pretty sick. Kind of reminds me of the Fortnite stuff. Uh, the Night Market banner coming back. The Night Market's coming back. Now, I will make a correction maybe in this video or in the future. 
especially within the future updates of this game. I'm not sure if the night market's only slowly for cons uh, sorry, PC right now and not console. This could be the first night market when it comes to console. And if you don't know what night market is, it's basically just the skins that you buy in the shop at a discounted price. However, this new feature is coming into Valorant soon. A blacklist feature is coming to Valorant where you can block it. When you block a player, you can't add you, group invite you, and they will be muted in game. Now, I wish they wouldn't be on my team. That's what I'm praying for. I'd rather not deal with people who throw my games. That's all I'm asking for. This first comment, they get it. But that's it for the patch notes, everybody. Peace out. Have a wonderful time. I'll see you in the future updates. Love you all. Goodbye.